before as we dive into this coffee tasting, could I trouble you to run over to the prop room and find a silly hat for everyone in the room? How many people? Could uh, someone from engineering uh, come and refocus the uh, performance camera so that we can see? Thank you, Alex. We can see Surge on the floor. I have one more request. Can somebody bring me a spit cup? Just, just in case. Yeah. Just gonna throw it out there that there, Sorry. these Surge. might not all be lead, uh, uh, drinkable. Surge, do you, do you need a, uh, a palate cleanser as well? A little bit of water. I have a water bottle in the back. That'd be great. Okay. Where is? I'm very excited for this. All right. Uh, so uh, last time, what happened is they had a bunch of random coffees, and I had to pick my favorite. And and uh, Johnny told me. I bet you McDonald's is one of these. So let's just let's just dive right into this, or do we need an introduction or something like that? They're, no, they're, I think we'll dive we'll dive right into yeah, this. Yeah, there's there's six. Do we hear Serge okay? Do we need the the performance mic? We could, we could probably hear him fine. I'm so sorry for that belch. <laughs> that, all that ice cream at once. <laughs> That's very nice. That's already better than every other coffee we had last time. <laughs> Watch it be the McDonald's. Can you, wait, can you describe the the first? Sure. One? So the first one is a little bit fruity. It's very sweet. It has a very nice taste. Um, I'm happy with that. I would drink that. I'd go out on my way. This second coffee, just from smelling it, is very dark. Very dark. Very roasty. I kind of don't want to drink it. I'm going to wait for the spit cup before I drink that one. Okay. All right, coffee number three. Coffee number three is also kind of dark. It's not on unple as unpleasant as this one. I'll actually drink this one. Okay. Okay. Yes, please. <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> so the problem with coffee number three is it's actually stale. And the way you can tell, tell if something is stale or not is the first coffee you drink and it's nice and it's pleasant the whole way through. The second coffee well, you have a stale. you have a taste, it's roasty, and then it just ends. It just like abruptly stops. Hmm. Uh, so Graham, uh, now that I've described that, I actually want you to have a sip of this just so okay. you can see what I mean by a stale coffee. Pass that over. Gently, gently. Yeah, there will be no physical uh, challenges attempted at this number time. number four. What? Yeah, it just tastes like roast and then it's gone. And it's gone. That's that's a sign of stale coffee. There's like no aftertaste. It just yeah. disappears. That has less to do with coffee um, being uh, like the roast process or anything. It's just it's just old. Wait, what is this? Uh, we, we don't know yet, but it... it here, try it. It just, I'm able to tell you it all just, all it just tastes like hella dark, like <laughs> roast, and then it just goes away. Oh, no, no, that's not, that's not even the roasty one. This is the roasty one, but I need a spit cup before I try that one. <laughs> Where's the spit cup? Get this, uh, I, have a, I have a mug. A empty mug? Empty mug counts? A mostly empty mug. It's got a little bit of coffee. So when you say stale, do you mean the coffee? Oh, here we go. It's okay, Joe's got it. It's, it's old. It's old. Camp. It's just after a long period of time. Uh, so something a lot of people don't know is coffee is organic. Coffee comes from a plant. People know <laughs> He's going somewhere with this. He's mined to the ground. So the, the, the significance of this is plants have seasons in different parts of the world, and so crops come out. So the idea that you can get coffee that is the same at all times in the year doesn't connect with the fact that a plant grows and has seasons. So it can get old, it sits on a shelf, and it goes away. So it, yeah, uh, it, that is... Old. That's true. I I haven't I, I know it's a plant. I haven't actually associated it with seasons. This is really good coffee. Just from smelling it? Yeah. This is sweet, this is fruity, this is lovely. This is lovely. This is so lovely. Oh my goodness. Taste this now. Okay. And focus specifically on the aftertaste. What number is this? This is this they're, is they're the fourth coffee I've had. Bottom. But I'm also yeah. very curious about on these. The bottom. Oh, yeah, we have to taste right. them. <laughs> I'm going back to coffee number two right now. Oh. I don't even want to drink this. Do it. I believe in you. I want to try this. Nope. Oh, dang. That's really bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I would like to clarify one thing. There is no McDonald's this year. Oh. There is also oh. no Fernwood. Ah. Uh, pass that yeah, one to uh, Kathleen. Please. Make sure we leave them in order. Now, the other thing to think for, about for, is, for is please. Yeah, but we don't know what what order Serge has been talking about. Please, not too many humans drink these because yeah. we don't all want to yeah. get sick. Yeah. All right, coffee number five. I can tell can just you, from the wait, color. This wait, is actually wait, 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 hold on. put the ones that you've taken back where you took them from, I know, so that I'm, we know what comments yeah. Surge made about them. I'm putting, them on, I'm putting four in the number fourth two. slot. That's number two. So coffee number five, I can tell just from the color, is not coffee. That's number two. Put put it. Put hold number on. two in number two. Hold on, let me smell this. Who does number? No, I got two. this. This is number one. Oh, I can oh. do it by smell. Okay. The bad one is two. This is number two. In every sense of the word. Yeah. <laughs> This is number three. All right, cool. You need to be around them 
Yeah, confirm number four. Okay, cool. So now you're on number five. What's number five going on? Number five is is tea. <laughs> That's Why? Just That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> just as a curveball. So right. <laughs> number five. Not waste. It's actually really good tea. She just wants tea. This is how we get <coughs> tea. And then I choke on it. Number five is just fine. Number five is not exciting, uh, but it is in no way inoffensive. So I'll pass it over there. Um, it's a little bit darker than the really, really, really nice coffees that I'm gushing about, <coughs> but it's very drinkable and very pleasant. And in the same way here, can you see how <laughs> that coffee is fresh? It's a little bit roasty, but it doesn't drop off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so that is probably a medium to a medium dark from a place. So like and, Starbucks? Uh, I, I mean, that could even be one of the Actually, darker roasts like Fernwood or something like, like that. Not even bit, well, they said, she said no Fernwood. That's not even yeah, bitter this, enough for Starbucks. This, this is a very uh, light flavor. Yeah, the yeah. Starbucks like the Pike Pike Place roast is like really quite quite bitter. Uh, so what is what is the goal here? Do we want me to arrange it in order of most favorite to least favorite? Yeah, go ahead. All yeah. right. And then I will tell you what they are. Sure. Number one, and I'd go so far as to say that this is this is probably an African coffee. Mm. I don't know. Mm -hmm. So you know where you're from. Oh, this is really mm -hmm. nice. I can wait. Two. Cool. <sighs> coffee nerd. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> well, the search did take me on a coffee tour a couple years ago, and it was really, really fun. And Very informative. Anytime I have gone to a coffee shop with Serge, it has been awesome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it was one year. Uh, and I'm actually, without a doubt, a better time to have you gone with Serge. Yeah. I'd like to try that. I was going to put my least favorite one so far away. It's going to go like over here. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so and actually, I can put my number one favorite more, more that way. Oh, yeah, that is. That's good. So, it's, like, really powerfully unpleasant. Be before we find out which is yeah, which, yeah. what I'm curious of now. Is if Emily could tell you oh. where she went, Christ. Oh, and you guess sure, yeah, okay. which one's which. So you have yeah. Order okay. You want. So one is from Beacon Hill. Beacon Hill Drive-In. Yep. Okay. Uh, there is one from Seven Eleven. Okay. Oh. <laughs> there is Starbucks Pike Place. Okay. That's their that's their darkest roast, right? Yeah. Uh, well, that's that's their normal medium. roast. That's their medium. Because they're me they're medium. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Habit. Okay. Which is also where my tea came from, and it is amazing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and the last one is from Fullepi. Oh, Fullepi. Fullepi? Yeah, Full I, was, I always heard it. Full 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 heard Fullepi. Interesting. Interesting, oh. interesting, we interesting. We have bows and arrows. Mm -hmm. I was expecting another place somewhere there, which is kind just, of great. Discovery? Just before Serge starts guessing here, uh, Engineering, I've requested an audio cue. Pardon? If we could fire up that audio cue real quick. Mm -hmm. Mm. Ah. And rotate the hats. Thank you. Hat I haven't had. Apparently, um, oh, no, I had that one. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, so habit was an option. Yep. So it's habit Seven Eleven. Um, Full of Beacon, Beacon Hill. It's okay. Beacon Drive-In. Yeah. Well, known for their cuff. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was hoping you would stop by like a gas station, just like a no-name well, gas station. Well, 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven was the closest like, we had. Oh, yeah. Like Husky Gas or something. This like was that. all things that would still be hot if we went and got them all on foot. Right. Have it full of pee. Starbucks. Then it was Beacon Hill. What was the other one? 7-Eleven. I'm actually oh. going to say, so this is, this is the order I'm going to go with. Habit has the best coffee. Okay. Full of pea is the second best coffee. Okay. The very neutral one that was fine is probably Starbucks. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm actually going to say that Beacon Hill probably had the worst coffee, mm -hmm. and 7 Eleven had something in the middle. All right. All right. Let's, Let's look at the letters. Find Let's out. find out. All right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and our best one. The well, best coffee work, was. Falepi. Oh, oh full interesting. Full oh, full good for them. Yeah. yeah. The nice. Best second best coffee was. Habit. Yeah, oh. that's. Yeah, very so, You know what? You said that, All right. So, you, to you be said honest, the Falepi had Bows and Arrows coffee? Yes, no, they no, did. No, no. Does Bows and Arrows also do the other one? They do Falepi. They do Falepi as well. That's exciting. So. I actually was worried about those two things because Habit doesn't often, Habit is always good, but never that exciting. But mm. I didn't think Fullepi had the ability to be that good. Oh, but right. that, that, was, that was hard for me to figure to out. Fullepi. Yeah, they both have excellent coffee. It's where I go for coffee in the morning. All right. Okay, Number three I said was Starbucks. And survey says? That is Beacon Hill. Really? Oh, oh, wow. Oh, I have 
was supposed to be McDonald's, Starburst which is why there's an M on the bottom of it, but they didn't make it that far. All right, uh, uh, the next one up, I, I said, <laughs> well, <laughs> Beacon Hill threw me off here, uh, so I figured the worst one was going to be Beacon Hill, so that's incorrect. So you said this one was 7-Eleven. I figured this one was 7-Eleven. You are correct. Oh. I right, got 7-Eleven, oh, so no. the worst, oh, no. the worst one in the whole lineup was Starbucks. Starbucks. The one that I actually oh, called oh, undrinkable. Oh. Yeah. 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 Matt, did that just fire off certain neurons in well, your head as well? Okay, so if anybody was watching on the wide shot when I had the bad one, I had a sip of it and was like, yeah. Yeah. And, then, and then I had like three more sips yeah. of it. Yeah. Um, which was like, yeah, it was clearly, like, clearly like, Starbucks. I know that. <laughs> I know <laughs> this taste. No, 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 no. I was going to say, pass that one okay, to Matt, that. and then uh, pass him that one. Which one's which? I, you, you will uh, taste I am not a fan of Starbucks drip, but they make great, what, what we call here at Loading Ready Around, yeah, what we no, call like, cupcakes. Much, much better They make great coffee. cupcakes, right. which Chicken is their go. ridiculous, syrupy, yeah. whipped, whipped whatever. Yeah. Frappuccino. Okay.